everybody and welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to give you an update on something that I'm going to add to the guppy tanks. And if you, I'll take you over here. I got some ghost shrimp. I got 20 of them and I'm going to add a few of them to each of the guppy tanks is the plan. But I wanted to show you how I'm going to acclimate them to the tanks. So over here, I've got a couple, it's a five gallon bucket and I'm going to put them in here with a little bit of, this is a bubbler and a little bit of the heater. I'm just going to slowly add a little bit of my water to these and I was going to share the process with you. So let me get this started and we will do this together. So this is everything set up so far. There's 20 ghost shrimp in this five gallon bucket. I have a bubbler hooked up for oxygen and one of my heaters in there to kind of help keep things a little warmer for them. They're supposed to stay between 70 and 80 degrees, so this should keep them about 76, this heater. I did go ahead and feed them a little bit. Let me go back over here, and I'll show you. That's what that looks like. But I'm going to use this jar right here to use, to take a little bit of water from my guppy tanks and acclimate them. It'll probably take a day or so and I'm expecting to lose probably one or two of them. I've never had shrimp, so I'm curious how this goes. And here's the pellets that I picked up for them. So hopefully that works. There's a few other things that I picked up. I got some prime conditioner for the water and for a new tank. I'm gonna set up, if you can see it, there's a tank over there I'm gonna reset up, so. Whenever I add some water to this, I will check back in. Okay guys, welcome back. I'm just going to show you. I got a little bit of water from my guppy tank and I'm going to go ahead and add it over here to the shrimp. We're doing pretty well. I haven't lost anything yet. And supposedly these guys last up to a couple years and they can grow up to a couple inches in size. And you can use these ghost shrimp as feeder shrimp or just to help clean your tank. I've just been adding a little bit of that water over the last couple of hours to these guys and so far I haven't lost anything. They're doing pretty good. I did end up accidentally getting three little guppy females in the course of just getting these 20 ghost shrimp. So I'll probably add them to one of these tanks. I'm not sure which one. But so far, so good. And I'll check back in. Hey everybody and welcome back. So far, I've been just slowly acclimating those 20 ghost shrimp to my guppy tank water it's been several several hours and they're all doing really well so i wanted to try to put one in here and see how it goes i uh put him in like a little floaty cup and i've just been drip acclimating him to this specific tank water it's been about an hour and it seems like he's going to do pretty well. So I wanted to let him go and have you guys watch it. And then I will do the rest here the same way, but it's going to take a while. So I wanted to show you just this one. See how the guppies do. Let's see how this fella does. 
Again, I've never had shrimp, so this is going to be a learning curve, and I went ahead and got the cheaper ghost shrimp. I was on a road trip today to try to find something completely different, which they did not have, so I wanted to go ahead and give this a try and see how they do. I've always wanted to keep them, but I wanted to try to go with something. These cost 30 cents a piece. A little cheaper to see how it goes. It seems like he's going to do pretty well. Fingers crossed. I am assuming I'll probably lose a little bit, but so far so good. But hopefully I did acclimate these guys long enough. I'm not sure. But thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments, leave them below. Subscribe to the channel. And thank you again.